The following contest is an eight-man battle royal and is for the WCW World Heavyweight Championship. Making his way to the ring from Hartford, Connecticut, weighing in at 297 pounds. A big time pounds. battle royal here, guys. Who do you like in this one, Byron? Well, historically, champion, you're safest when you put your Ken money on the biggest Herman. superstar. But to be honest, I'm not sure. I can see any one of these competitors walking away with a... And from Detroit, Michigan, weighing in at 275 pounds, Freakzilla Scott Steiner. This will be a sight to be seen, guys, as these superstars all compete for the same goal here in this... Talk about power. You talk about this man. And from Colorado Springs, Colorado, weighing in at 273 pounds, Bobby Lashley. Byron, you shouldn't even be in the same arena as this man. Why not? And from Palm Springs, Florida, weighing in at 231 pounds, EC3. Put the and kids to bed, lock up your valuables. Someone's about to get beat up real bad. It's the 24-year-old piece of gold. Byron, I know one of your favorites, Mike Kanellis. Well, I wouldn't go that far. And from Boston, Massachusetts, weighing in at 205 pounds, Mike Canales. You know, we joke about his belief in love, but Mike Canales has physically and mentally transformed over the last two years and is in the best shape of his life. Who's joking? 15 years of experience around the world. They're going insane for old Mikey boy. Love is in the air, gentlemen. The human embodiment of the phrase, it's not the size of the dog in the fight, it's the size of the fight in the dog. 
It does not get any bigger than Rey Mysterio. And their opponent from San Diego, California, weighing in at 175 pounds. He is one half of the wrestling world tag team champions, Rey Mysterio. If you haven't hit record yet, now might be a good time to do that. These guys are going to have a match you'll want to watch over and over again. He's starting to stumble here. He needs to create some space and find a way to get back on the offensive. Ouch. You've got to believe this one's over. Not where he wants to be right now. Hey, he got himself into this mess. He's got to get himself out of it now. What a stop. Trust me, if you're a WWE superstar, this is not where you want to be. No way. Oh, so tear the features clean off your face. Damn it. He's looking a little wobbly here, guys. Michael, his legs look like they're about to give out on him. Oh, what a right! Yeah, that's an attitude behind it. He's looking banged up here, guys. And it looks like things are about to get even worse. He's fighting back here. I expected nothing less, Cole. Ooh, what? what a clothesline! Ouch! Drop kick! Great athleticism. Oh, what a DDT! Wow! Oh, it's over! Here he goes. He's making a statement here with this attack. Bad spot for him to be in here, guys. He's got to do something to get back in this thing. He's left wide open here. I don't think he even realizes it. He looks dazed. This is about to get bad. Ooh, what impact. He looks a bit off his game here. Oh. He came into this match expecting a fight, and that's exactly what he's getting. The good news for him is that he doesn't appear to have taken too much offense up to this point. But that can obviously all change here. Burn Karana to the outside. Victory is on the horizon. Not a lot of superstars can pull off a move like that. Rotating vertical suplex. Nicely done. That's what he was looking for, Michael. Oh boy, he is rolling. Almost five years after his previous NXT match, EC3 made his return in grand fashion, opening NXT TakeOver New Orleans in a six-man ladder match for the newly minted NXT North American Championship. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. Going for it all here. Close line. Can he finish the job? Just endless knee strikes. Definitely not where you want to be right now. Gotta find a way to get out of this, Michael. When this guy's on, look out. Caught him right in the jaw. Ugh, what a shot. He's looking a little off balance. This very well may be too much for him to handle. This is where we find out who the better man is. And at this point, it could very well be either one of these guys. That's how close this thing is. Oh, close line. We well, you know that Bobby Lashley has impressive skills once the bell rings, but he's had to prove himself in some strange new ways as of late. Uh, Michael, you must mean the time Sami Zayn made the Dominator run in obstacle course? Or are you referring to Jinder Mahal's yoga session? Not where he wants to be right now. Hey, he got himself into this mess. Well, he's got to get some other drop. Incredible. I'm not sure how much he has left. He's left wide open here. I don't think he even realizes it. He looks dazed. This is about to get bad. Ooh, but he's got to capitalize now. Oh, boy, he is rolling. Great job escaping, trying to turn this thing around. And look at the quickness by EC3. Wow. Ashley just barely got out of the way. Oh, 
Oh, nasty impact. We have the final elimination, and that's all she wrote. That match deserves another look, folks. Wow. That was some seriously painful action to watch. Watching paint dry might have actually been more exciting. These superstars didn't exactly set the world on fire, but this match had its moments, as we see here. Here is your winner, and the new WCW World Heavyweight Champion, Bobby Lashley! Big win here in this elimination style match. I can assure you, Michael, that that match was just as tough mentally as it was physically.